As dawn broke, the gentle light showered the school in hues of blue and green, transforming the ordinary into extraordinary. A peculiar sight greeted students as they arrived. Their teacher, a turkey with a vibrant spirit, prepared for the day with anticipation. He stood proudly at the front of the classroom, his ruffled feathers shimmering in the ethereal light streaming through the skylights. The air charged with a sense of wonder and curiosity about what the day might bring. Suddenly, a mesmerizing phenomenon unfolded before him. From the floor, a soft, ethereal mist began to rise, illuminated by the classroom lights, bathing the space in a soft, white glow. The teacher felt a strange, tingling sensation emanating from the enchanting cloud. It felt both peaceful and intriguing, like fine grains of sand cascading upon him, whispering secrets of magic waiting to be unveiled. He quickly gathered containers to catch the drifting substance, even filling an inflatable pool, enthusiasm bubbling within him as he pondered what astounding adventure lay ahead for his eager students. As the first student entered, the mysterious mist ceased its ascent, leaving everyone awestruck by the remnants of wonder. The turkey, sensing their curiosity, placed a container of minuscule beads before each child, shimmering with absorbed light. This feels like sand, had exclaimed one student, sparking a cascade of amazement among the others. Just then, another magical substance began rising, this one even finer, resembling a delicate cloud of smoke. Its beauty captured the students' attention, and their hearts overflowed with joy as they sank their hands into the magical inflatable pool filled with these captivating beads. With each touch, they felt a gentle magic enfolding them, sending tingles of happiness through their fingertips. With the sun reaching its zenith, they headed to lunch, their minds still swirling with the morning's enchantment. As they munched on their sugar cookies, the resemblance of the sugar crystals to the morning experience struck a chord. Back in class, the turkey demonstrated a fascinating experiment. When a fan blew over the fine beads, they floated gracefully, creating a visual spectacle akin to a tranquil sandstorm. Each gentle drift against their skin felt fiercely delightful, a lesson in magic and science intertwined, leaving them clamoring for more adventures that blended wonder, knowledge, and joy. After the joy of the day came to an end, the turkey returned home to find something enchanting outside. Sparkling snow had begun to fall, dazzling in the floodlight's bright bluish-green hue, reminiscent of the classroom experiences. As he watched the glimmering snowflakes dance through the air, memories of his classroom adventure flooded back, planting a playful smile across his beak. The next morning, the turkey stepped outside into the winter wonderland. The snow underfoot felt strange, almost like he was walking through a carpet of the minuscule beads. Each step was met with a delightful, tickly sensation, a gentle reminder of the magical classroom activities. Was the universe cleverly communicating with him through these enchanting moments? Arriving at school, he was eager to present the incredible beads to his class once more. This time, he structured it like a Scottish burn supper, emphasizing that before they could immerse themselves in fun, each student would present the magical activities. They would share with pride, accompanied by the vibrant sounds of bagpipes, generating excitement and anticipation for the day's special experiments. As the children listened intently, they were prepared to uncover the mysteries behind the beads once again, fostering a sense of curiosity and joy that perfectly encapsulated their magical classroom. The classroom buzzed with excitement after the unique Scottish Burns supper-style presentation about minuscule beads. The vibrant colors of the tiny orbs, coupled with the quirky presence of their teacher, Mr. Turkey, turned a simple lesson into a memorable experience. As the students eagerly waited for the QA session, their minds bubbled with curiosity. One brave student raised their hand, cutting through the anticipation. What color are these beads, they inquired, eyes wide with wonder. Mr. Turkey leaned forward, his costume feathers ruffling slightly. Well, he began with a twinkle in his eye, the color of these beads varies depending on the light displayed. If yellow light shines, they reflect yellow. If the light is white, they take on a bright white appearance. This simple explanation sparked a ripple of enthusiasm across the room, feeding further questions. Another student chimed in. Does that mean the beads will look like snow? Mr. Turkey nodded, his smile widening. Exactly. And if we combine blue and green light, they shimmer in a way reminiscent of the ocean. 
The classroom filled with vivid images as the students visualized the magical transformations, the inquiry led to a plea for a demonstration. Mr. Turkey, could you show us, asked a particularly eager pupil. With a warm smile, the turkey agreed. He turned on a gentle fan, watching as the beads floated gracefully through the air, catching the sunlight streaming through the classroom window. Adjusting the classroom lights, he revealed a shifting palette, each hue a curiosity that danced in the students' eyes. Then, in an unexpected flourish, he turned off the artificial lights and opened the window wide, flooding the room with a stunning burst of cyan blue and green. Suddenly, the floating beads reflected the hues, creating an enchanting scene that looked like an ice-filled land, albeit without the chill. Awestruck gazes filled the classroom as Mr. Turkey then activated the three color switches, red, green, and blue, each equally set. The beads exploded into a visual spectacle, creating a winter wonderland effect amidst the bright, welcoming atmosphere. The students were spellbound, whispering among themselves and wondering out loud, does this happen in real life? With a chuckle, Mr. Turkey shared that he experienced something similar that very morning on his way to school, a personal revelation that connected them all to the beauty of light and color in their everyday lives. Through this magical lesson, the beads transformed not only the room, but the way these students perceived the world around them. As the final bell rang, students burst from their classroom, a haze of laughter and energy swirling around them. The vivid scene they had just witnessed, filled with tiny shimmering beads, still danced in their minds. Each student was spellbound, the allure of the visual spectacle igniting their imaginations about what it could be like to encounter such wonders in the real world. The sounds of joyful chatter filled the hallways as their excitement took flight, propelling them towards the school exit with a sense of adventure lingering in the air. Outside, curiosity took over as something extraordinary emerged before them. In a moment reminiscent of their previous spellbinding experience, the students felt once again that unmistakable sensation, vibrant and alive, it was Mr. Turkey, the endearing teacher with a passion for learning, gathering his belongings in a joyful farewell to the day. He too couldn't shake the enchanting feeling that had wrapped around him in the classroom, hinting at a deeper connection to the world beyond what they could see as Mr. Turkey stepped outside, thoughts drifted through his mind like clouds in a blue sky. Was it mere coincidence that his path crossed with the children's? Or was there a greater communication at play, a bridge between the universe and the school? A sense of pride blossomed within him as he recalled the days spent inspiring his students. With a smile lighting up his face, he took out his Scottish small pipes and let the notes flow, filling the air with melodies that danced like the beads under classroom lights. Suddenly, a passerby caught the sound, their intrigue evident. With wide eyes, they asked about the sand swirling around, and Mr. Turkey, always eager to share, replied with warmth, Oh, that's the universe communicating with me today. I was teaching a class. An unexpected bond formed as the stranger revealed their Arapaho background, astonishment glimmering in their gaze. This was a sight unseen in all their years, a talking turkey in hues of cyan, teaching lessons beyond the traditional. The conversation flourished with joy and wonder as Mr. Turkey explained the beauty of cayenne, a blend of blue and green, lighting the path for the Arapaho to envision their own colorful teepee. Encouraged and inspired, the Arapaho felt motivated to create, leaving with newfound dreams in that moment, it was clear. Mr. Turkey's impact extended far beyond the walls of a classroom, resonating through lives intertwined by curiosity and creativity.